Can I have an autograph? Oh, that is what I'm freaking talking about, people. On the freaking bottom, are you kidding me, Panini? Oh my gosh, I freaking knew it. Boom, come out here. With a red prospect, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Oh, it is an auto. Oh, it's Vlad Guerrero Jr. Huge hit, massive, massive card. That is a massive card. Seven. Very few people knew that Pee Wee Reese and Jackie Robinson were going to be great teammates. They would become the boys of summer. Jackie Robinson, though not embraced by all of his teammates, did indeed win them over one by one. Pee Wee Reese, another southerner, was the first to really embrace him. Pee Wee, from the outset, felt that if I were the only white guy, trying to break into our black league. I'd want somebody to be my friend. And he says, if Jackie Robinson has the ability and he can make it, that's all I'm going to ask. We had some deep south boys on there, you know, from down in Alabama and Georgia, and they didn't appreciate it at all. And if you sat down and played cards with Jackie or something, they would let you know about it. You know, hi, in the world can you sit down and play with us, so-and-so. Hey, man, he seemed like a pretty nice guy to me. To Philadelphia. What's up, everybody? Sports card fam coming at you on a Friday. Yeah, yeah. So, got a one package mail day yesterday, actually. Didn't have time to make a video, so I'm making the video now. So, judging by the background, you can guess. Yep, another addition to the 1953 Topps Hall of Fame set. Yeah, yeah. Uh, today's edition I'm super excited about and I wanted to pick up a decent copy of um, it's not super high up as far grade but this guy's card definitely jumps as the grade gets higher and he had an, a very big impact on baseball and it has something to do with that guy right there so without further ado my number six edition to the 1953 Hall of Fame set. Here we go. Watch out. 1953 Pee Wee Reese in a VG3. And just like the others, such a beautiful photo. Well, actually, it's paintings. But man, they did such a good. Everybody's just, it's crazy how. Stinking nice this set is. Uh, it never gets old me looking at them. It's a little off-centered on this one, but I'm really not too worried about it because the background is kind of a off color, so it doesn't stick out as much as, say, Roy Campanella, who I've been looking at, and boy, do off-center cards from him stick out. And we'll see what I end up picking up out of him, but, you know, I... I don't know. We'll see. So, super stoked to add this to the collection. Very big impact on baseball. Great Hall of Famer. And number two in price behind Jackie Robinson so far. So, super stoked to add it. It's a super awesome card. Super awesome set. That is what I got for you. 
Shout out Mike Baseball Collector who finally decided to grow up and start getting the 50s Hall of Famers to join the club. But anyways, happy Friday. We'll catch you later. Got a few more coming in. Can't wait to show you. And we'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.